In this video, I'm going to show you how to set a content author for Facebook and for Twitter for the content that you create on your WordPress website. Welcome to All-in-One SEO. We make SEO easy with our powerful WordPress SEO plugin. Let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is install the All-in-One SEO plugin. If you already have AIO SEO installed, you can skip ahead to the next part of the video using the timestamps below. So let's go ahead and click on Plugins and then click on the button that says Add New. If you haven't done so already, we're going to want to download the plugin from AIOSEO.com. You're going to go to the Account section into your Download area and click the big green button that says Download AIO SEO. And if you don't have an account already, you should be able to create one pretty easily. So back on the Plugins page of your WordPress website, we're going to go ahead and click the Upload Plugin button and then click Choose File and choose the plugin file that you just downloaded. And then click the Install Now button. After the plugin installs, click the blue button that says Activate Plugin. After the plugin installs and is activated, the AIO SEO Setup Wizard will pop up automatically. We have another video that walks you through these steps, and I highly encourage you to go through that wizard because it will just set up your whole website for success as far as your SEO efforts go. But for now, we're going to head back to the dashboard. And then if you scroll on down the page and click the link, there's a space for us to enter our all-in-one SEO Pro license key. Back on our AIO SEO account, which you can find at aioseo.com slash account, make sure you're on the Downloads tab. And then next to where it says License Key, if you click on the icon, it will copy out our all-in-one SEO Pro license key. And then we're going to paste the license key into the License Key field. Click Connect. And that's it. All-in-one SEO Pro is activated on this website. If you want to be doubly sure, you can go ahead and click the blue Save Changes button. And then we're going to scroll up and click on the Dashboard link, just so we're all on the same page. So now that you have All-in-one SEO installed, let's head on over to the All-in-one SEO menu on the left and click on the Social Networks link. On the tabs up top, let's go ahead and click on Facebook. And then I want to scroll down to the bottom of this page where it says Advanced Settings and click the toggle switch to turn Advanced Settings on. So then we're just going to scroll down to where it says Facebook Author URL. And you're just going to type your URL in here. I have mine copied, so I'm just going to paste it in. We have a handy link to the All-in-One SEO Docs if you want some more information on how to get your Facebook Author URL. There's a little line of text here that tells us this will be overridden if the Facebook author URL is present in the individual user profile. So I will explain what that means in just a minute. But now that we have the Facebook author URL here, I want to scroll down to the bottom of the page and click Save Changes. And that's it. Now your content will be associated with this Facebook author URL anytime someone shares your content on Facebook. As far as this part about this setting being overridden, AIO SEO gives you the ability to have multiple Facebook author URLs and to associate them with different users on your WordPress website. So if we scroll back up on this page and on the left-hand menu, head on over to where it says Users. I only have one user on this website, but if I click on Edit for my user, if you have All-in-One SEO installed, you'll see that you get another tab here next to Personal Options on the Profile page that says Social Profiles. So go ahead and click that tab, and then we can associate social profiles specifically to this user. So if I had five different users on my WordPress installation, they could all have different social profiles associated with them. It's the same situation here. I just type it in or copy it in, scroll down to the bottom, and hit Update Profile. If you only have one Facebook page associated with your Facebook website, then you can just set that up the way we did in the first part of this video. So if we head back on over to the All-in-One SEO menu on the left and click on Social Networks, and then on the tabs up top, click on Twitter, I can show you how to set this up for Twitter. So the first thing you want to do is next to where it says Enable Twitter Card, you want to turn that toggle switch on. And then we're going to scroll on down to where it says Show Twitter Author and make sure that says yes. That's all you have to do for this. There's no other settings to enable that Twitter author. 
So scroll either all the way up or all the way down and hit the big blue Save Changes button. And you're done. So that's how to set a content author for Facebook and for Twitter. If you don't already have our awesome all-in-one SEO plugin installed, we've got a link to it in the description below this video. It can help you out with the task in this video as well as many other SEO jobs that you might have to do on your WordPress website. If you click on this next video right here, I'll show you how to set a default image for when someone shares your post on Facebook. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks on how to use our easy and powerful WordPress SEO plugin, All-in-One SEO.